A new state report shows black and Hispanic drivers in Virginia were pulled over by police at a disproportionate rate when compared to other drivers last year. Eugene Daniel takes a look at the data and asks experts what needs to be done. A new preliminary report by the Virginia Department of Criminal Justice Services reveals disparities in Virginia traffic stops when it comes to race and ethnicity. Out of roughly 950,000 reported traffic stops in 2023, data shows nearly 30% of drivers stopped were black, despite making up roughly 19% of Virginians of driving age. What we've seen since 2020 with this Community Policing Act data is that um, the racial disparities among traffic stops, unfortunately, have not changed much, but the disparities among searches have declined, which is a good sign. Rob Pogan class is the executive director of Justice Forward Virginia, a nonpartisan group that advocates for criminal justice reform. Four years ago, they helped push a state law aiming to fix racial disparities in traffic stops and searches. He says there needs to be more studies on why people are being stopped. We can never settle for where we are today, we've always got to try to improve. John Jones, executive director of the Virginia Sheriff's Association, says a deeper dive into the findings could be helpful, but he does not think the report proves bias or intent by law enforcement. If you think about it, if you look at the back of a car, the side of a car, you can't tell who it is. I don't, I don't think you can draw any conclusions, and maybe a study of a deeper dive would be in order, but not from this DCJS data. It's just data. Jones says the use of body-worn cameras and dash cameras also helps to hold people accountable. But former police chief and law enforcement consultant Kenny Miller says the data does show there's an issue that needs to be addressed. Is this a problem? Yes. If people of color are being stopped and they're being stopped disproportionately, that's a problem. For 13 News Now, I'm Eugene Daniel. The Virginia Department of Criminal Justice says though the report shows disparities, it does not measure or prove specific reasons for them.